In this experiment, we're going to investigate the effect of nature of reactants or type of bonds on the rate of a chemical reaction, and we're going to be using a qualitative approach. Now, when we say qualitative approach, it means that we're not going to take any measurements, such as time or volume. We are simply going to observe which one of these solutions is going to decolorize the purple potassium permanganate solution the fastest. So that is what we call a qualitative approach. Here I have an oxalic acid solution. The formula can be written in two ways. This is a covalently bonded compound. Here I have a solution of iron 2 sulfate. I just wanted to show you the green color of iron 2 sulfate. This is an ionically bonded compound, and when it goes into solution, it forms the ions Fe2 plus and SO4 2 minus. This purple solution that I have here is potassium permanganate, KMNO4, and then I have some dilute sulfur sulfuric acid at the back here. Please take note of the color produced by various ions in solution. Fe2 plus ions render solutions green, Fe3 plus ions render solutions orange, Mn7 plus in MnO4 minus render solutions purple, and Mn2 plus render solutions colorless. I am going to add this potassium permanganate solution to each of these beakers simultaneously. But before I do that, I need to add a few drops of sulfuric acid to each beaker. I'm adding five drops to each beaker. I'm now going to simultaneously add these two and we are going to see which solution in my beakers is going to turn the solution colorless the fastest. You notice that the purple solution turned colorless immediately in the iron 2 sulfate solution, showing that the reaction between iron 2 sulfate and potassium permanganate was very rapid. I just wanted to show you that the solution in this beaker did eventually turn colorless.